Our sisters, do you not want to be with Aisha and Khadija and Safiya and Sauda and Zainab and Um Habiba and Um Sulaim? Do you not want to be with the believing women in Jannah? Do you not want to be as Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has described them in Jannah? That in that, in that paradise in Jannah that they'll be given everything that the heart desires. Everything. That Jannah, my brothers and sisters, about which the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said that every Jum'ah, every Friday, that there will be a market. Every Friday, there will be a souq, a market. And the man will leave his palace. Leaving his wives behind, he will go to the palace. Oh sorry, he will go to the souq. And while he is in the souq, a cool breeze, or a breeze will blow over him. And that breeze will beautify him more than he is already beautiful and handsome. So when he returns back to his wife, and his wife welcomes him back, she will say to him, Oh my husband, you are more beautiful than you have ever been before. More handsome than I've ever seen you before. And whilst he was away, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala had increased the beauty of his wife and made her more beautiful. More beautiful than he could ever imagine. So when he sees his wife, he will say, By Allah, you are more beautiful than I have ever perceived you before. Jannah, ya ikhwan. This Jannah where you are with the ones whom you love. You are with those individuals that you worshipped with, that you prayed with, and you desired the company of. So if you desired the company of the mushrikeen, and the kuffar, and the mubtadi'ah, and the evildoers, and the wicked doers, then as the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa said, you will be with those whom you love. You will be with those whom you love. So let us love the believers. Let us love the Anbiya and the Rusul. Let us love the likes of Nuh, and the believing women, and the believing men. If we love them, then perchance Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will raise us with them, ya ikhwan. As one of the Sahaba, when he came to the Prophet sallallahu he said, Ya Rasulullah, I have not. He asked him about the hour. So then he said, what have you prepared for it? The Prophet said, what have you prepared for the hour? Yawmul Qiyamah, what have you done? That you're asking about the hour. He said, Ya Rasulullah, I haven't done much. But I love Allah and I love his messenger. So then Allah subhanahu wa Allah's messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam said to him, you will be with those whom you love. So we love them. We love Allah. We love his messenger sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. And as the sahaba used to say, that I love Allah. I love the messenger. I love Abu Bakr and I love Umar and I love Uthman. I love them. So may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make me amongst them yawm al-qiyamah. So may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala cause us to love those believing men and those righteous men so that we may be amongst them and in their companionship yawm al-qiyamah. And what an excellent hasuna ulaika rafiqa. What a Excellent companionship that is. Barakallahu feekum. Walhamdulillahi rabbil alameen. Wa sallallahu ala nabiyyina Muhammad. Wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam. Jazakumullahu khairan.